Hey guys, here's gonna be another review for you today. <clears throat> um, recording this one right after the D6R, just time for time and time wise and whatnot. So uh, here we got the Norscott Cat D6K track type tractor, bulldozer, and 150th scale. Um, one thing to note real quick is that again I removed the ripper, so yours will have a ripper if you buy it, when you buy it, when you get it, whatever. Um, for a Norscott model, this one is actually pretty nice. I like this one. I really do. Um, so we'll start off with functionality, like usual. The Both cab doors, they do open and close, which is very, very nice. I really like that a lot. You could see Norscott stepped up their game in 2007. <sighs> um, their tracks here, they are tensioned. So, they will stay tight. They roll, but on a smooth surface, they really don't. The blade raises up to there. And it does have a degree of left and right tilt movement. Um, obviously, when you have the model with the ripper, the ripper will go up and down. So, there's that. All the handrails on this one are plastic. The uh, exhaust stack is plastic, cab doors are plastic, this uh, piece up here, the cab top is plastic, as well as this air conditioning unit. Um, cylinder jackets are plastic, but on all most models they are, so I'm not worried about that. One thing I like about this model in particular, as you can see here, they painted the rivets, there's no shiny rivets. So, that's, that's a good addition, actually. Um, there's no real hydraulic line detailing from the engine to the blade, from the actual machine to the blade. There was some for the uh, ripper, but seeing as it's gone, that has to, be, that has to go, too. Um, what else? Let's see. The cab is relatively detailed. I mean... Hold it up to the camera here. You can see there, there's a couple of controls, a few panels, seat. It's not too bad. It's not too bad. Um, let's see, what else? I mean, it retails for $56 right about now after their price increase. But even then, I would still say that it's probably about, it's probably about worth it. I mean... What are you going to get from Norscott? You can't expect too, too much. Opening doors and painted rivets is enough for me to spend this much money on this little dozer, but... Um... I mean, hell. You go to first gear and buy one of those D51s for more than this, and it doesn't have opening doors, so... Might as well go with this. Same size. So, uh... Yeah. I mean... The blade has uh, bolt detailing on its cutting edge right here. I don't know how much the camera focused there, but... And then on top of it here, you can see the cylinders and the whole arrangement. The radiator's plastic, if I didn't already mention that. I'm pretty sure I missed that, but whatever. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching. If you guys want any more reviews... Just leave a like down below and uh, comment comment your review uh, in the comments box. Uh, where else are you going to put it? So, uh, yeah, have a good day.